Hi, Ben. This is Brianna with Tori Art Digital Marketing. Thank you so much for letting Amber know that we could go ahead and send you this video. I'm just making this quick video to give you tips on how to have your website speak Google's language so you guys can start bringing in more customers for free. We're doing this because I used to own my own roofing company here in Alaska, so I do understand a lot of the struggles that contractors go through, and I also know that business owners reach a point where they're running that business and they're so busy, they don't have that free time to just sit in front of a computer and learn how to make the internet work for them to bring the business to them. And we found what holds owners back from hiring a marketing agency to do that is obviously not knowing which one's going to be an expert or which one's going to be a waste of time and money. So we really believe in giving that value up front and we've been making these free attack plans and giving them away for free. There has been a lot of business owners that do reach back out to us and ask for our help to get this stuff completed. So if after this video you see that we know our stuff and we can deliver you good results, then you can always give us a call back just to chat. If you want to take the information and just make the changes yourself, please do. This is free education. So I'm going to be talking about three Three quick points today content citations and backlinks so I'm on your home page here uh, you guys actually have a great looking site and we know that re reviews are always like the most important step of business for us um, now Google isn't ranking your site based on the appearance though. The appearance is definitely for attracting the customers. But Google is using bots called crawlers that scan all of the content within your site to try and find keywords to rank you for in the search results. So for Google, content is king. It's recommended that you put at least 1500 words on the home page and at least 500 words on each back service page. You also want to use a rule of thumb, 100 words of content for every one keyword. When you have your site set up this way, it's going to do two things. It shows Google you're an expert in the industry, and it's going to have Google ranking you higher on more search results, which means more business. Um, these methods also work well for us attracting new employees as well if you're looking to grow the crew. Now, I actually have an example of a keyword here, which is Patio Covers Las Vegas, getting searched 1,300 times a month. And we know it's area specific, and the cost per click for an ad is only $5.37. So, you know, there is search volume happening. Now, clearly, when customers do a search, they're going to see this Google Map Pack or Google My Business. You want to get this optimized by adding your company contact information, photos, and website. Then you need to get citations. A citation is just an online directory like Yelp, Yellow Pages, White Pages, BBB. There's thousands out there, but you want your information on at least 100 directories more than your competitors to start ranking in the top three here, which is where people tend to spend their time. Now, if we continue down, these are the organic search results. Now, the top five sites here, Google actually rotates for that first position, but your top competitor is Ultra Patios, who's also dominating the Google Map Pack. So I'll be using them as your competitor for the remainder of the video. Here we can see just how much content and what they kind of set their site up as. And they have a little less content, so this could be one that's going to be an easy competition for you to beat. Now, on the other side of things, we use a tool called AREFs. This is showing what's happening on the back end of your site. So I can see your homepage has a strength of 19, and the domain ranking is sitting at a 13. To optimize this fully, you want a 1 to 1 ratio. Uh, the domain ranking is made by the backlinks. So a backlink is when another site online is linking to your site and driving traffic to you. Google is very competitive, so they enjoy seeing backlinks, but not all backlinks are created equal. So before you link to another site, you want to be sure that it's high ranking and relevant to your industry. Uh, right now you have 267 backlinks coming from 57 sites. You have 194 keywords. And I want to point out, you're running some ads. Now, if you look at these ads, those keywords don't show that buyer intent. Um, a lot of them are really, I mean, they're not area specific. So these search volumes here each month are nationwide. And it's very low, as you can see. And that's not what we want to target, um, especially if you're paying $12 a click for the name of a company that's not your own.
uh, when I gave you one that is, you know, being searched as many times as it is, that's area specific and cheaper. So we really focus on that return on investment when we're running ads. Um, so I just wanted you to be aware of that. Also, with some of these ones down here, they're not that customer buyer intent because most customers don't know the names of products as we know they don't know they're not really great with materials or just knowing the specifics of all the different types of products contractors work with so you may be targeting more of contractors on a few of these um, now if we go back out here all of this is bringing you about 93 traffic each month um, Sorry about AROFs, they keep doing these weird number things that appear. <laughs> um, if we look at your competitor, though, we're going to see their homepage ranking is sitting at a 32, and the domain ranking is a 13. So what we would do is find the highest quality backlinks out of their 800 and put them onto your site to give you that authority. Then we'll go hunt down even more backlinks your competition isn't using to make sure you're outranking and beating the competition. So they're, they've got those 800 links coming from 156 sites they have 224 keywords but you can see here they're not paying for any Google Ads and right now they're getting this traffic monthly of 305 so even if only half of the visitors to their site called them they still got several you know over 150 opportunities to get business um, so there is real opportunity for growth there is a search volume you just need to have Google's language on your site a little bit uh, so you're gonna want at least 1500 words on the home page at least 500 words on each back service page keep that rule of thumb a hundred words of content for every one keyword then you're gonna want to get your company information into as many online directories as you can and you're going to want to get high quality backlinks relevant to your industry. With these three steps, you'll be ranking number one across Google. Now, I know this was a lot of information, but you can take it and apply it yourself. Like I said, this is free education. My team is really just looking for the feedback to know that we're delivering good value when we make these videos. Obviously, we don't want to waste anyone's time. Um, but if you did need any help with this stuff because you're more interested on the advertising side versus the bringing in the things organically like this, go ahead and give us a call. We can have a chat and we'll see if we're going to be a good fit together. We we can get your phone ringing off the hook with customers or even employees. Um, also, I think with the industry you do working more solely on the rain gutters, there's an opportunity to use algorithms to target you getting opportunities to work with roofing companies that subcontract the gutter work if that's something you're interested in. Uh, so thank you so much for letting us send this video, taking the time to watch it. I'm sorry it's a little long. <laughs> My partner will follow up in the next few days to get your feedback, so I hope you got good value out of it. Take care.